So here we are again with Paper Mario Master Quest. And it's time to go back to Toad Town, do the Junior Trooper fight, see what exactly that entails. Um, <clears throat> now in Pro Mode, this Junior Trooper fight coming up, it's actually a... Uh, it actually, he dizzies Mario right off the bat, um, and yeah, he dizzies him, or if you have Feeling Fine, he increases his attack power, which I would prefer, but I don't have Feeling Fine, so basically Mario's going to start off this fight dizzy for like a turn or two, whatever it is, I, I don't remember. Um, I'm going to want to put on Spike Shield for this. Zap tap, oh, that might not be a bad idea. How much does spike shield cost? Three. Alright, you know, I think I'd rather have that on than zap tap. Um, and let's also put on close call. Just in case. Uh, and let's... Okay, let's say that's it make a quick save here, so not to go all the way back. <clears throat> so Junior Troopa rolls around, and swims around with the eagle. Alright, time to fight Junior Troopa. Mr. Junior Trooper, are you going to be tired? Yes, you are, and you have 20 HP now. Fantastic. I'm going to check what else I have in store for you, a dizzy dial. Three turns of no Mario. Uh, that's going to be a bit rough. Alright, let's tattle him. He only does three damage though. Alright. That's fine. I just wanted to make sure he had, actually had 20 HP. And it's not like when they did this they forgot to, you know, when they made this mod they forgot to update the cutscene to have the correct HP. Like, they give him 60 HP and then cut it down to 30. Anyway, um... I'm gonna switch to Watt, and then let's start attacking. He only does three damage, so I'm fine. I am a-okay. That's actually perfect. Perfect damage. So, yeah. Okay, that was the easy boss fight of what I'm about to do. I'm sure Junior Troopa is going to be much, much harder. I mean, not Junior Troopa. I'm Electro Booper, which actually I'm gonna want. Uh, I'm gonna want to put Zap Tap back on. Um, so take off Spike Shield. What did I put on? I put on Close Call. Put Zap Tap on. Let's go on quickly heal.
<laughs> no badges, right? No. Um, alright, first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get the, uh, I'm gonna try to get the, uh, the block here without any issues. It's easy with the, I would say it's easy with the, Ah, wow, twice in a row. stone. Um, so there's one, two super blocks in there. I'm trying to think who I want to upgrade for um, the blooper. Probably Bo actually, getting fan smack. But fan smack probably costs like 15 FP, so it's not a good idea. Broken Barrio for multi -bonk. With double charge, one hit kill. Okay. Hey, one turn kill. Mm -hmm. well, yeah, let's um, let's do that. I never upgrade Gumbario to Ultra Rank first. There's a reason for that, but still, Gumbario's not like a bad partner. He's not as good as Bella, but he's not bad. He's cool. He does his thing. Actually, I should save, too. I mean, I'm, I can save state. Actually, before I save, I can also get life shrooms, actually, too, while I'm here. But, you know, I'm, I'm doing pretty well without life shrooms. I mean, I've had my deaths, but overall I feel I feel okay without them. Well, maybe I'll get some. Well, I'll, I'll get some after the blooper fight if I need to. Um, so what was I doing again? I was just making sure I have jump charge, power bounce. Okay, good. Let's go. Let's get sushi out. Time for the blooper fight. 
Electro Booper. Who, uh, well, let's see how much HP he's got. Wait. Wait. Hold on. I could have sworn, and uh, playing this late, I may be tired, I may have misread, but I could have sworn it said to consecutively hit head bunks in the description for. Let me see how much it does. Okay, I have to actually hit it though. I can't hit the action command. Is it supposed to be like really tough? I assume it does... well, it wouldn't make sense for it to do six, because Mario does six. Hold on, I, I've, I've got to see this again. I swear it's, it, uh, it doesn't work. Alright, hold on. Ugh, oh, I can save... Do all this again just to get Gumbario the right attack? No. I don't. I made a mistake and I'll just have to live with it. <clears throat> I just have to live with it. Wait a second. I saved. I saved! What? No, I s Wait, 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 wait. I saved at Boo's, Boo's Mansion, didn't I? Wow. Alright, ah, this is a sign I probably shouldn't be playing this right now. I'm reading things that's, that aren't there, I'm saving in spots that I shouldn't be. Uh, I am so messed up right now. Alright, let's do this again. I'm not actually going to put this all in the video again, I'm just going to skip to where I was, because... Yeah. There, it says it right there. He'll master multi-bonk and be able to head-bonk consecutively. It's not me misreading it because I'm tired, I am reading it correctly. This is a bait and switch. Obviously an oversight. I know I'm putting everything together, that's fine. Alright, it's fine. Nice people will put this together. I know they did it for free. You know, did it on their own time. Not gonna hold it against them. But... Maybe this can be fixed. Maybe... If it isn't already by the time I actually upload this. Um, so... Uh, but anyway. I wonder how many other ones of these are bait and switches. Like, all right, let's see, let's see. So, both fan smack. Since Gumbario doesn't have multi bonk, but with fan smack, that's probably the next best thing. So, let's do that. Fan smack. There you go. That is still a thing. Excellent. Excellent. Alright. 
hit this. Make the save. Alright, I definitely made a save there. Um, alright. Take off spike shield and take off, um... I'll take off close call. Let's put on Zepta. I'm going to start with Gumbario. Well, actually, I'm going to start with Sushi, because you have to start with Sushi. But then I'm going to switch to Gumbario, to Tattle. And then I'm going to... What was I going to do? I'm going to switch to Watt, I mean Bow, and then start fan smacking this guy. Alright, so let's do this again. So change over to Mario. We're going to Tato. This is Electro Blooper, Electro Charge. ADHP, that is a lot. Alright. So, let's charge. I don't have to worry about the baby bloopers at all. Let's charge again. And boom, you come out. Okay, that's the third charge. Now I fan smack. Okay, he's gonna charge, but it's fine because I have zap tap on. like 30 dam 20 damage 30 damage something like that it's insane This fight is easy. Very easy. Big whooper down. I'm gonna fight these baby ones. Still not dead. Good 
Goodbye, blooper. Hold up, let me just make a save. Soda and another one. <clears throat> and um, I'm going to go back into the sewers. I'm going to save the volcano for next part. Let me just go in here, take a quick look around. That just yet. But what if there is a new hidden area right behind this wall? No. There is not. Alright. Let's do this. I'm gonna buy lots of things from you. That's two. That's three. That's four. That's five. That's six. That's seven. That's eight. Nine. That's ten. And the thing after that is just him giving you dried shrimps, so. Cool. You tasty, I need you to make me something. I need you to take this dried shrimp. Turn in one of those, those shrimp fries. Or fried shrimps, whatever they're called. You know what? Do the same thing with this mushroom, too. Just get a couple life shrooms. Oh, you know what else actually I can do? Come to think of it. There's another super block I can get now. <clears throat> another one. And then another star piece, too, in Toad Town. Speaking of star pieces, how many do I have? I didn't even get the star pieces from Chuck Quizmo after Chapter 4, so once I'm done with Chapter 5, probably be like 10 to 15 of them I can get. Oh wait, hang on. Check these. You know, let me also just sort things out a little bit right now. Oh, I 
forgot I had this other mushroom. Would have cooked it. All right, what do I want to sell? Um, all right, sell the vault shrooms since I'm never gonna use them. And the vault shroom. I have a few mushrooms, actually. Alright. Oh, and I can fight Wacka some more, too. Keep one life room, and let's just claim uh, all right, these two fried shrooms and the fried egg. That should be good for now. There's a super block here. And actually hit it. Um, let's go with sushi. I think, are there any mandatory fights in the volcano besides the boss that I'd want to paralyze enemies for? Um, let me also just save state here, just in case there's a bit another bait and switch and one of these things are different from what they actually are. Uh, yeah, I guess what? No, you know, sushi. Sushi. Yeah, let's just get sushi out of the way. 
gonna rank her up, so may as well get it done. Let's just take a look, make sure it's actually Tidal Wave. It is, and it costs 10 FP. Okie dokie. Back to yeah, my HP and FP all filled up. Yes, it is. I do have all the items I want. Um, so let's head back over to Chapter Five. Actually, no, you could jump off that. Can you jump into the volcano with me? Yes, you can. How interesting. I didn't really jump into the volcano, I jumped into the lava, but... Ah, oh, same difference. Oh, there's no save block out here. Alright, well I saved over there, so... That'll be it, um... For this part. In the next part, I finish up Chapter 5. The saga of Chapter 5 will come to its conclusion, finally. And I will get the most powerful star power of all star powers. Heal me for 20 HP. Maybe she got buffed, and heals like 20 FP now. Well then refresh would be totally useless. So, maybe 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 40 HP. Yeah, 40 HP. This way refresh can still have the FP gains to it. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe, 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 maybe the star power will just cost 2 SP as opposed to the 5 or 4 or 3 or whatever it is that it costs in a normal game. Anyway, I'm done. I will see you next time.